Wait, where's the explosion? You know, the fun part about movies like this is you want it to be as real as possible. But a lot of the times you're trying to figure out the what if. You know, the last extinction event of this planet happened, you know, billions of years ago. And so we did a lot of research on the on the extinction event that um, leveled 75% of the plant and animal life on this earth on this earth with the dinosaurs. And we wanted to try to bring that into a modern day feel, as well as maybe it's not one impact. Um, that we're waiting for the entire movie, but also the science behind how fragments of... But we wanted our monster to be able to strike at any given moment. The way that classic horror movies work, or the way that classic disaster movies work. And one of the things that we found in our research is that asteroids and comets, meteors, a lot of the times will break apart over millions of years because they'll collide with other things, collide with themselves, and they'll start bouncing around like ping pong balls off of each other until there's suddenly hundreds, if not thousands, of these fragments. Some small enough that they don't cause much damage or it will burn up before they hit the atmosphere. And others, just like a lot of the craters that we have around our, um, around our planet today, are for ones that are capable of taking out not only cities, but entire regions. And so what it does is it gives us a perpetual monster that can strike at any given moment. Um, yeah, I think the themes of the movie are very, very powerful. I mean, the obvious ones like humanity and um, family, you know, there are so many great people in this movie that help each other out, just as there are many terrible people who are taking advantage of a, a vulnerable situation. Um, but I think ultimately the movie is positive and it, the rebirth of, you know, he, the human race is going to happen and we are going to um, survive in the face of this incredible peril and you know, it, it does make you think about your life a lot and make you think about what what would happen if this actually happened to us. And it doesn't seem that far off. I mean, it doesn't seem that crazy. That's what's so scary about it. And it's also what drew me to the movie. It's, it's an action movie. It's fun to watch. It's harrowing. It's terrifying. But it's very real. Um, it is something that is very palpable and plausible. Oh. But the sky's on fire. The largest fragment will hit in less than 24 hours. <laughs>